was your day? Swell. Yeah. I got uh, red and white. I didn't know what you'd be serving. Oh, that's nice. Is anyone eating this? No. My husband tells me you're in sharks. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Well, yes, I, I've never heard it quite put that way, but uh, yes, I am. I love sharks. You love sharks. Yeah, I love them. I love them. When I was 12 years old, my father got me this boat, and I went fishing off of Cape Cod. And I hooked a scup, and as I was reeling it in, I hooked a four-and-a-half-foot baby thresher shark who proceeded to eat my boat. <laughs> he ate my uh, oar hooks and uh, my seat cushions. He turned an inboard into an outboard, scared me to death, <laughs> and I swam back to shore. And when I was on the beach, I turned around, and I actually saw my boat being taken apart. And ever since then, I, yes, I have been studying sharks, and that's why I know that uh, I'm going to go to the Institute tomorrow and tell them that you still have a shark problem here. Why do you have to tell him that? Sorry. I'm sorry. I thought that you told me the shark was caught. And I, I heard it on the news. I heard it on the cave station. They caught a shark. Not the shark. Not the shark that killed Chrissy Watkins. And probably not the shark that killed the little boy. Which I wanted to prove today by cutting the shark open. But you, you know, you want to let that breathe for... Nothing. Nothing. be the only rational man left on this island after I leave tomorrow. Where are you going? Uh, I am going on the Aurora. The Aurora? What is that? It's a floating asylum for uh, shark uh, athletics. Uh, pure research. 18 months at sea. Martin hates boats. Martin hates water. Martin, Martin sits in his car when we go on the ferry to the mainland. I guess it's a childhood thing. It's a, it's a clinical name for it, isn't there? A... Drowning. Listen... Is it true that most people get attacked by sharks in three feet of water, about ten feet from the beach? Yeah. And, and, and that before people started to swim for recreation, I mean, before sharks knew what they were missing, and a lot of these attacks weren't reported. That's right. Now, this shark that, that, that swims alone... Rogue. What's it called? Rogue. 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 Yeah. Now, this guy, he... He keeps swimming around in a place where the feeding is good until the food supply is gone, right? It's called territoriality. It's just a theory that I happen to agree with. Then why don't we have one more drink and go down and cut that shark open? Martin? Can you do that? I can do anything. I'm the chief of police. Elementary canal. Open the digestive tract. He is a rogue. 
and there's any truth to territoriality at all, we've got a good chance of spotting him between Cape Scott and South Beach. Where are you going? We've got to find him right now. He's a night feeder. On the water? Well,